One way to boost your productivity, especially in data entry and manipulation, is to use FlashFill. So FlashFill is available since Excel 2013. So if you have this and you didn't use it, watch this tutorial. You'll be amazed by the things that you can do with FlashFill. So in the first example, I have the names of some employees and I want to get the first name. So the old way would just be I will have to type each one on its own or I'll have to use text to column, etc. But what I could do is use flash fill. So I'm going to write Mario here and press enter. And what I could do is go under home. You have here fill, then flash fill. And you can see that automatically Excel extracted the names of the other employees. So I could do the same for the last name. So for example, I can write Marino here and then I can press Ctrl and E and it will do the magic. There are two things that you need to remember for flash fill. One is that this is static. So for example, if the name of this person changes, this is not a formula, so it will not automatically change. And the second one is that if you try to do the same thing, but far from your data set, it might not work. So for example, if I do Mario and then I do Control E, then I'll have an error message saying that there is no pattern. Excel could not figure out what I want. Here I have the same employees and I want to create emails. So what I could do is write Mario dot marino for example at let's say the company name is called desk dot com then i'll go for vicente if you see as soon as i try to type vicente excel will automatically tell me that it can use flash fill so if i press enter i will get all the emails in no time the third example is about proper case so if you see here some of the names, they have lower caps, upper caps, etc. So I need to fix them. So what I could do here is write Mario Marino the right way, press enter. Then I can just drag this or double click. And then if I click on this, I can choose flash fill. And you can see that all the names came in the right way. Example number four, extracting initials. So here again, I have Mario Marino, I can do MM, and then if I try to type Vicente, you can see that it's not working. I got VV because the pattern is not clear to Excel. So I can do VR, and then what I could do is Control E, and you can see that I get the rest. Final example, I want to extract males and female from this. So here, for example, it's M. If I do now Control E, here you will see that I have a mistake. Why? Because Excel thought that the M is for Mario. So it took the V for Vicente. So what I could do is just delete this and then write M here and then Control E. You can see that it's working perfectly. Flash fill is a very useful tool. You just sometimes need to give it more than one instance. So Excel can identify the pattern and then it can just do the work for you in no time, as you can see from those examples. So let me know if you have used FlashFill before and whether you knew about the capabilities of FlashFill. And as usual, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. That will help me make content like this one.